briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1992, the New York City Housing Authority, NYCHA, settled allegations of racial discrimination in public housing assignments by agreeing to implement a new tenant selection plan. However, in 1995, NYCHA proposed a working family preference, WFP, that critics argued would benefit white families and maintain racial segregation. The district court issued a preliminary injunction against the WFP, ruling that it would alter the racial makeup of top applicants and hinder desegregation efforts. The court then permanently enjoined NYCHA from implementing the WFP at 20 housing projects with disproportionately white populations. Nietzsche appealed the decision, sparking debates over what constitutes segregation and whether the proposed changes would perpetuate it. Nevertheless, the appeals court upheld the district court's findings and maintained the injunction at 14 of the housing projects, while reversing it for six projects. The court determined that the permanent injunction against the WFP implementation at the 20 housing projects was not an abuse of discretion and ruled that Nwaicha could request a modification if white families' occupancy decreased to 30%. As a result, NYCHA remains permanently enjoined from implementing the WFP at these 20 projects. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.